Hey, what's up, guys? Sonic says, "What are you guys?" The next part of our playthrough of Sonic Adventure Two for the Xbox 360, as a part of our road to Sonic Frontier. So, in the last video, we started off. How can you not see that, man? There is clearly enough light in here for that. The last time we started off the hero story, and today we're gonna try to finish it. And now it's on to Aquatic Mine, which is to find the three pieces of the Master Emilia they get. We do have one thing we do have to do first. This way, we get to go get the air necklace first. There we go, we have the air necklace, an oxygen tank necklace. You can now breathe underwater, yes. It's also, not only does this serve useful for this level, this is gonna be incredibly useful in the last level of the game, which is Cannon's Core. But you will see that whenever we reach that, which is technically in like three parts from now. we know we actually have an idea on where our first piece is. How I many it's literally showing up yellow here. What? What? Yeah, you did on accident. It's okay. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and guess it's in sentence. Is it in here? No, it is not in here. Okay, what about this way? No. Okay, hold on. Like pretty much right on top of it then. Oh, there it is, right there in freaking front of my face. It was a bro moment. We could have got that just a minute ago. Alright, let's see here. Where where could the next one be? Hmm, I wonder if it's down there. Part of me wants to say it is. Alright. Okay, yeah, we're, we're, we're close. It's in here. Oh, 
Ah, okay. We're near. We're near. We're near. There we go. All right. One more left to get. Knuckles keeps getting jump scared, though. Okay, camera spazzed out there. Oh, all right, we're already on to something. Wait a minute, do we have to? Or are we already here? It's on there, it's somewhere. And there we go. That is it for Aquatic Mind. That actually wasn't too bad. It took us five minutes. We spent a good bit looking for something that was right in front of our face. I said it made like a C rank or something. Yep. Not too bad. Took a little too long to probably get a good rank, but eh, that's okay. It's not an E rank, and we beat the level, and it didn't take 30 years like it is the first time on Pumpkin Hill. But we're through the level. That's the important part. Don't have that much to give out, though. Have a seal for our boy. Run speed. We didn't really kill any enemies over here. get back to it. Or Knuckles just suddenly just decided to turn sideways. It just looks silly. See about pull Knuckles' head off, right off of his non-existent neck. And then we're starting to move on to Route 101, which is Chase the President's Limousine. Okay, which kind of brings in the fourth style of gameplay, which is only seen twice in story mode, which is the, uh, the cart driving section, which actually is its own mini game. So, it's pretty much just as simple, just keep driving. And we can also drift, which... <laughs> Ooh, that actually makes this kind of fun. Other than that, I'm going to be honest with you though, the drift, I actually figured out how to drift kind of makes these levels a little bit more fun. You're going to need to know how to drift if you actually want to get a good ranking on these levels. Because doing it without drifting and just basic stuff is going to make it almost impossible to get an A rank. I've never got an A rank on this level. I have got an A rank on Rouge's level. 
which I don't know how in the world I, I ever did that because I did not drift at all. It's just very weird. And also, Rouge's level is a lot more difficult than this one. I think I think was it like 20 rings? You can press uh, you know the Y button or you know triangle or whatever, whatever controller you're using. It's the the upper button on within the four you know buttons that you can actually do a little boost and gain some speed. I will give a little bit of advice. You have to be careful here because, yes, there's guardrails, but there are possible chances where you can get airborne and you can actually fly off the edge and die. And if you die, you have to restart the entire thing from the freaking beginning, just like that. Okay, I did not, I did not mean for that to happen. Like, that was not intentional. I'm like, being serious. It was not intentional. It was not in my plans. It's a little ha ha funny joke, but I'm not laughing. Bro is not laughing right now. Okay, I am a little bit. That was kind of funny. Oh my goodness, I thought it was gonna happen again. I was like, wait, didn't I just didn't I just have this problem? I was doing really good. That was like the best run I've ever had on this level. Oh, and now I'm over running the wall. Come on, at least a C ring, that's what I want. If we get a searing, that, that at least means we did at least mid. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my God. Tells us on crack. Ah. But it's okay. That's pretty much the end of the level. Because we drive into the JPEG image that's in front of us. It actually is the JPEG image, by the way. Excellent job, Tails. Excellent job. So there we go. That's it for Route 101. Whoa, what the heck? I got an A. Let's go. Yo, what in the world? Nice. This has never happened before. Let's go. I got that on video, too. That's even better. Now, watch me say that and don't get corrupted or something. Like, now, kart racing with three courses is now available. Mr. President, reports show that since the incident three hours ago, the country is in turmoil. Our financial communities are impacted and our satellite communications are down. An emergency meeting has been called. Mr. President, this is a national crisis. Spare me the details. Exactly just what is it that you want? Dr. Redman. <laughs> well, Why did you pause me such a business then, shall we? Mr. President, I won't bore you with all the details since I know you are a very busy man. Mr. President, my demands are quite simple. Surrender to the Eggman Empire and make no attempts to resist. Otherwise... Otherwise... Otherwise your country will cease to exist. You have 24 hours to give me your answer. No way!
So yeah, we get back-to-back -back Tails levels as we we'll hang on to Hidden Base. Our objective is to find the entrance into Hidden Base, even though we're doing the level Hidden Base. The irony in that statement. Okay, now our biggest thing here, don't fall into the sand because it's instant death. You'll get a whole nine and a nice clean thousand points there. That's what I'm talking about, Tails. Let's go. I can get the combo there. I can get Tails to turn over quick enough. Look what me! I look, I could literally... He literally couldn't take down the other guy. I don't feel like going for that shotgun. I feel like it's a bit of a trap! Okay, actually, wait right here because there will be that robot that just pops up. And if you're not careful, he will shoot you and you will die. Trust me, I've had that happen more times than I can count. Oh, come on, man. You didn't have to do me like that. You could have let that one slide. Show that nice 1500. Just over here. Yeah, actually, they tell us it's Mystic Melody power-up is down there. We can't get it just yet. Because we actually need a, uh, another power-up from Tails that is not going to be available until, like, probably his next level. Which is actually Tails' last. Taking should be almost at the end of the level. Let's 
true. Points, and there we go. That is it for Hidden Base. There we go, another A rank. Which hidden base, as long as you get through without dying, you can get like some of those combos, is actually not that hard to A rank. But now it's time to go into Pyramid K, which was infiltrate Eggman's hidden base. Don't expect an A rank here though, like I highly doubt that's actually gonna happen. But, yo, the music though, that I ain't gotta get. Fly through some of these, you can go ahead and get yourself some extra points as well. The good thing about this level is mainly having to worry about these hourglass here that'll open up the doors. Also, a, uh, another power up for Sonic coming up. There we go, it is the bounce price. It. Press the B button while the mid jump, use the bounce stat. Press the B button and once again, jump higher. We're just gonna use. Oh my goodness! What I would like to take is being able to see what the hell I'm doing. Dang, dude, get off me! Okay, that actually works. I will take it. Sonic, I need you to, like, go, dude. Watch out, because that's a trap. And we got the shield, but you didn't hit the, the thing. I need you to hit the thing. Oh, you can homing attack that? I had no idea. Legitimately had no idea you could actually hold me tight. Oh wow, yeah, I was definitely gonna be able to get that. Thanks, game, I guess. The Golden Beetle was up there, but I... That is going to be it for Pyramid Cave. Be right to take it. Too easy. Piece of cake. We'll absolutely take it. I don't know. I might have to end off part of the video. Like, it should be one part, but if it gets too dark, it gets. To the point where we can't can barely see the screens, then I will be editing in another day. Of the 
Big Ed sure loves mechanical things, doesn't he? I'll bet he has one or two spaceships lying around here somewhere. The door's locked. We need a key to get in there. No problem. We can find it. Right, Knuckles? What? Why do I have to find a key? We're counting on you, buddy. The world's greatest treasure hunter. Whew, I just farted. That smells like straight ass. But anyways, on the death chamber, we gotta find the three gate keys. We still have a power we need to go find his knuckles. Which is actually right here. The hammer gloves increases your punch type power. You cannot break iron containers with just a punch. Now, this is a level that's not really well liked within the Sonic community because it can be very confusing. And of course, you know this shitty radar system that Sonic Adventure 2 has does, does not does not help the case. Ah, Knuckles! What the heck, man? It was right there. You could have got it. Is it here? Yep, there we go. What the? What's in here? Oh. <laughs> oh, didn't mean to crash your party there, buddy. Take the shield though. Oh, what? Man, you did not just let that dude snipe me like that. It's in here, it's in here, it's in here. Is it above the beetle? It is, all right. One more left to go. Woo! Oh, there we go, extra life. We'll definitely take that. Okay, I don't know what the fuck you just did. That is not what I wanted you to do, nothing. God knows what. 
Bro, if you don't. There we go, that is it for Death Chamber. Look at that, we did it under five minutes, hit it faster than the aquatic mine. And got the A rank. Yeah, this is perfect. Ha <laughs> ha. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Let's go. Huh? Who's there? What the? A ghost? A ghost? And we interrupt Sonovich to bring you freaking Scooby Doo. It's King Boo Boo! Yes, that's right. It's time for our, our next boss. Feels like it's been a hot minute, pretty much, and it has been. The biggest thing is, how to beat this guy, we have got to manage to. Get behind him, knock that, knock the hourglass from that ghost's hand, and then turn to do a shadow we have to do is we gotta chase this man down. Luckily, we don't have to precision aim, we have to dig with the knuckles, punch, and if you can manage to get there just quick enough, you can get extra hit on him. So we're gonna do just want some walls in there. There we go, he only has four hits, he's already got two of them. Chases. Let's go. Run, Knuckles, run! Okay, we're gonna have to wait and turn. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to. So, once it gets like that, we've got to bait this man, stay in sight. Until he starts like breathing fire. Then we go running back. And there we go, we have defeated King Boom Boom. It's just too damn loud. Whoa. Even the song's like, whoa. So, yes, we get back to back boss fights. This is like actually kind of rare in the Sonic series to get back to back boss fights. Because now we get to fight the egg golem with Sonic. Not a difficult boss, as long as you know what you're doing. Big thing about this was we're going to do is we're going to want to hop on these platforms and not fall like an idiot like I just did. The news is, and like, you know, with Tails, Sonic's actually, you know, light and nimble enough to actually be able Shit, dude, what the hell? Stick that damn platform out. I mean, what the fuck was that, man? Oh my god, Sonic, you better not fall off for a third time, man. We're just gonna wait here. 
It's on the bottom thing, and this move will not touch you. And attack that, and hit that. And you're pretty much moving. Space colony where Eggman is hiding. What? Is everyone all right? We should be landing oh, no. soon. The hatch door no. broke. Sweat it, Knuckles. The only thing in the cargo bay are those what do you master mean, emeralds. Sweat it, right? Land the shuttle and let me out. We're gonna crash this thing if you keep that up. Oh no! Don't touch that lever! Knucklehead, anyway, trying to take over the show. I thought we were toast for sure. Huh? Where did he go now? Looks like he bailed. This place looks deserted. Dusty, too. This place was shut down about 50 years ago because of a terrible accident. The first Bernoulli spherical space colony called Ark. When it was operational, it was the most advanced research center of its kind. But looking at it now... Now it's an abandoned ark, wouldn't you say? There's not much time left before Eggman fires that weapon again. We've got to hurry. Let's find the cannon and destroy it. Yeah! Someone designed that weapon to be impenetrable from outside attack. Its defense shields are super strong, so we have to find a way to destroy it in the It looks like it doesn't, but in fact it's a fake one I created after researching the real emerald. It has the same wavelength and properties, but it's less powerful than the real one. It's designed to reverse the energy field inside the chaos emerald. Necessarily. I think I'm going to wait before we actually do Eternal Engine because I don't know. How is this going to look? No. It actually doesn't look that bad. I'm going to wait. Alright, boys. It looks like we are 
back. Right, boys, we have light. We actually have freaking light. I finally found light bulbs that actually fit because I was like smart enough to look. But anyway, it's time to move on to Eternal Engine now, which means hopefully we're actually going to be able to spit these out because I still have a shit ton of videos to do in a month and a half. We're actually going to beat this out before Sonic Frontiers. The odds of that happening are probably incredibly low that we're actually going to be able to finish this on time now, but. Hell, we gotta try. Okay, here. there we go. That was lame. What the heck? You didn't have anything for us? All right, so these dynamite packs here. Okay, no tails. No, 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 no. Please do not wonder like that. So the big thing about these dynamite packs, these actually open up paths to space. Oh my god, dude, tails doing that. And you can watch Omatel infinitely die right there. Oh, are you s man? Oh, bro, that freaking sucks. This still doesn't mean we're not going to shoot him for points. I mean, come on now. Fucking the camera right there scares the shit out of me because. I've actually done really, I've actually done really well in this game, haven't, like, I think I've died, like, how many times, let me see, honestly, probably, like, legitimately, I think we've only died, like, twice so far, we died at the end of Green Forest, which I, I had to restart, like, I just had to do it, and then we, uh, we died in a, uh, root, what was it, fuck, Route 101, I can never actually remember the name of the level. This so level's pretty simple. If you can go from beginning to end without dying, you've got a pretty good shot to get an A rank, and obviously manage to. Ow, you a hole. Okay, try not to fall in there. We don't want to get sucked out into space. There we go, got that health. And checkpoint. Ow, I literally walked right into that one. Watch out for these things, because they those will actually explode and will cause you to take damage. Okay, pull the bridge up with Wow. I can't help but feel a little triggered. 
Oh my goodness, that's, dude, that scared the hell out of me, man. Whoo, dude, that low key terrified me right now. Switch the come back up here. His tail is has a power up to get. Which is the bazooka, the Vulcan cannon power. You can now break iron containers that you couldn't break before. It's always a, a win. Yes, now we can destroy these things with tails. Oh, shoot. Yeah, so just hover there and just do not let go of the A button. That's my advice to you on that segment is just don't let go of the A button. And we still get the golden middle. Let's go. Oh, no! supposed to see that oh my gosh if I come all this way to freaking die And there we go. That is it for Eternal Engine. Ah. Uh, didn't, didn't really get enough combos there for sure. But, eh, be right. It's not terrible. We'll take it. So now we get to go on to Knuckles' final level, which is Meteor Herd, and it's back to finding the freaking castle. Actually, now I want to go and get a power up for Tails, though. So give me a minute, and we'll go do that. <clears throat> all right. So now we can come all the way back to this other little section that was over here. That I don't know if you guys actually managed to see. Laser blast a lock on missile power. Missile spreads that explodes, destroy enemies in a wide area. So right now I'll see you guys in Meteor Herd. Uh, of course, I'm trying to milk as many of these as possible. Now we get to move on to Meteor Herd. It's like, now ah, let's try this again. Okay, which have a power we want to get for Knuckles here? But look, in all honesty though, this level actually really, really, really sucks. Punch that, knock that down. Press that. that actually opens up the bottom of this area right here. 
If you can't get into just shit, you can either take a rocket or you can just do what I'm doing and just climb up here. I will take that extra life though, 100%. Sunglasses. See things you couldn't see before. Change the action window with the Y button. Press the B button to use. Just jump to take them off. Here we go. Some extraries. And that extra one. I should think they should. Do I actually have to climb? I thought there was a spring. Dicked around for the last minute and a half. Can you like shut up? All right, there's two and a half minutes. Still going green. Okay. What? You were literally just green a second ago. Is it? Does he have it? He does. There we go. I was about to say, dang. Spinner containers. Yeah. 
high place. Hmm, wait a minute. What if we go all the way to the top? Oh, come on, how was I supposed to see that? But good job catching that rainbow, Nux. There's a Mystic Melody spot. Guys, it's time to fight Boobs the character, also known as Rouge the Bat. Ow! Woman, get back here. We're not done. Where'd she go? Where did she go? Where did Boobs go? Oh, there she is. Your ear doing though, bruh. Really, bro, get off the mic, man. Knuckles was able to catch her and hang on. This is all boinged out, dude. She could have fell in the lava. What is the matter with you? Ain't no way it just reassembled like that. Trying to look away and dip. He said, I'm out of here, y'all. Who's this is we? 
She said, oh my God. Now there's the matter of Amy and Tails and Troubles. We move on to the penultimate stage of the hero story, which is Crazy Gadget. And it's Star Trek. It's to hurry and find Eggman. I'm telling you, man, for some reason, we ain't played a Sonic in like a minute. Even though we literally played this man in Pyramid Cave. We fought a boss with this man. And no, don't don't expect no A rank run from this level either. At best, maybe like a B C run C rank run. Oh my god, I hate the artificial chaos so much. I have no idea. Oh my god, Sonic grabbed the thing, bro. Don't do me like this. Speedrunners, people that are actually like legitimately like experts at this game, can just like do the bounce bracelet and just fall on that road. I can't do that, dude. I would, knowing me, I would whip that shit so hard. I think I just did it right there though, but it doesn't count. Oh man, I almost did it too. I had 600 points for that too. Oh, let's try it out, bro. Let's go. Damn, Sonic, I thought you were gonna attack all three, not just one. That's the only reason why I actually charged that shit up. You just let me down. <clears throat> oh, what? Bro, Sonic, how did you miss that, my guy? You're making me look bad. Or worse than usual. And you still got hit right there. Yeah, this is probably gonna be like a C rank run, I can tell you that. Right now. But that's okay. I'm more satisfied being in love without dying. I, that's that's good enough for me. Oh, what happened to the camera right there? Oh my god. Ah, uh, no, what? Oh my god, no, Sonic, we need to go. Cause <laughs> like Sonic, we need to go. Flamely. This allows us to do a powerful fire somersault. I was just like, no, Sonic, you got the. Oh my gosh! No, what the fuck? You know what? Since, since, since I actually died right there and just refused, we're gonna go ahead and get Sonic's other power up that we need to get, which is the magic glove, which might actually help us with that. Change the magic hand in the action. Press the B button when an enemy is close. Capture enemies and turn to a ball try throwing them at other enemies. So in other words, see this enemy right here? Boom! There we go. So Sonic's all of his except for his Mystic Melody. We should have to get Tails' his Mystic Melody. That's right, I almost forgot about that. We actually better go ahead and do that real quick. Alright. So we just come down here. Oh my gosh, I actually couldn't see there. Now we have Tails' Mystic Melody. So this is that chow key, and there we go. Now we can head back. Do the story mode. <laughs> he 
he's coming. Pause. All right, well, let's try this again. It's time for the 15th and penultimate stage of the Heroes, which is crazy gadget. Our objective is to hurry up and find Eggman. Woo! Yes, sir. Here we go. The magic hands have use. But that doesn't mean I'm going to stop for every artificial chaos that I see because that is for sure not happening. And this will even save us a couple of seconds at that one part since we don't actually have to go for the flame ring now since we've already got it. Enough for me, man. Oh, shoot. Okay, the next one. There we go. That's what I was trying to do, actually, somehow. Oh, got him from behind. It's another pause. Okay, no, no, no. Just go, just go, just go. You didn't have any rings. It's okay. Man, how in the world do I keep missing him? That's, that's making me mad. Oh, he blocked me that time. Okay. Well, he blocked me that time. tried it. No! Sonic! What the fuck? Oh my god, you look like such an idiot. Whew, I thought it was gonna fucking hit the bounce price and I would I would have absolutely lost my mind right there if he would have did that. Dang camera, what are you doing? Whose side are you on? Side is bro on. Oh, oh no, what the frick? I forgot he was there. Uh, we're not getting an A rank anyways, it doesn't matter. damage from hitting that? That is lame. That is so lame. What the heck? Well, it's my fault. I keep facing one direction and the game just suddenly decides to throw me in another one. I swear to the good lord above, 
if you were to roll off right there. You 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 playing too much now, my guy. You are playing way too much. This stage more when it came back for Dream Trampoline instead of its actual incarnation. Do not hit that spring without hitting that. You will die. I am just telling you that right now. His enemies, I am. Not studying these guys. You get to, you live. going ballistic. Dang, I just actually just barely grazed the X button, but there we go. That is it for Crazy Gadget. Too easy. Piece of cake. I forgot that Goku. Maybe we would have got an A rank. I don't actually know what you needed to get it. I feel like sixteen thousand might have been it, but uh, you know, I'm I'm good with the B rank. I'll take it. Don't 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 pet him right now, Summit. We gotta. Well, we didn't even really have to pick him up. But don't, don't be running. I don't want you to throw the guy. So I saw him just dart sideways for a second. I'm like, yeah, he's he's him. This cutscene really shows how evil Eggman can actually be.
<laughs> or when this game came out, like, like what they actually, like, oh my god, they didn't actually kill Sonic, did they? <laughs> what are you talking about wavelengths? I'm learning about that in, like, something like that in class, bro. Michael Bay ass explosion. This for you to tell so much when he wasn't such a bitch. He actually would, would fight. Like he wasn't scared. I don't understand how Tails regressed so hard as a character. Like, I don't understand that. Like, I do not. But, yo, it is time for the second fight with Eggman. And this fucking, like, the fucking difficulty spike here is fucking ridiculous. Holy... Like, you get no rings, your health bar is what you get, and it is very easy for Eggman to fucking, like, combo your ass with big-ass laser. But guess what? You just lost to Tails, motherfucker! Hell yeah! That's what I'm talking about, Tails. You're gonna be a man. But if you can dodge the laser and get behind him, then it's actually not that hard. I feel some strange energy. <laughs> Look, Sonic has been reborn. <coughs> and he died instantly. And indeed we will. It's time to move on to the final level of the Hero Show, which is Final Rush. We must hurry and find the point of the cannon. Now, don't expect a good run from this level, because I am absolute dog shit at this level. I, I think I've only beat this level one time without dying. Ooh, nice, nice, nice. So I get, see, I get hyped for doing that. When freaking, like, actual good Sonic players can speedrun this level in, like, a minute and a half. gonna work. Oh, it worked! What the frick, yo? It worked! Try to cut through. Oh my god, the bounce braces. This shit is trying to be in another direction. It didn't work. Shit. It was not a good idea. Why the fuck did I do that? I don't know why. It's because I used the bounce brace. It wasn't for that I actually would have fucked. Yo, wait a minute. No, 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 no. This is actually salvageable. It was salvageable. It was salvageable. No, I can, I can fucking do this. No, I actually want to restart the level though. This is a salvageable run though. See, this is what I mean. Do you see the kind of bullshit I try to do? Like, bro, I think I'm him when it comes to this level. And we each know damn well that I'm not. Actually, no, because I actually want to try to go down here. Oh my god, the camera, bro. Why you do Don't do this to me now. Nice job, nice.
There we go. It took like four tries, but we got it. thing for that, try to do a little jump dash on that to actually gain momentum. Oh my, what are you, what are you, what the fuck are you trying to hit anyways? My goodness, I knew that was eventually bound to happen. It's been here too long, or else he's gonna snipe our ass. What the? Why would? Why are you trying to do light speed dash on one ring? That made no sense, there, my dude. Ten minutes, shit like that gives me a heart attack. Oh my god, I can't. Where's popcorn? Excellent. Oh, there's extra life there. Dang it, man. Okay. So the chance to get Sonic's Mystic Melody is things coming up here. Pretty soon. Actually, no, this was it. Excellent. Thank, thanks, game. It's actually where we needed to go was here. It's actually, oh. And there we go. We got Sonic's Mystic Melody. I will take it. running and there we go yes. that is it for final rush Ooh. Too easy. Piece of cake. b rank i'll take it yes sir
exploded in space. Yo, it's actually time. Without a doubt in my mind, this is one of, if not the best final boss fight in the entire Sonic series. The original final showdown between Sonic and Shadow. Which actually starts out pretty simple. It's not hard to hit Shadow until probably the... Unless you get too far behind, like you just use his chaos control. See, he'll spawn in, hit him with that. Now we actually have to start baiting Shadow into attacking us. Which to do that is we gotta let him get far enough ahead. that yeah you're right about putting that to rest shadow we have beaten shadow And yo, there we go. That is it for the Hero Story and Sonic Adventure 2. I still got to react to like two trailers for Sonic Frontiers. But uh, we're, we're, we're going to get to that eventually. Let's go ahead and just chill out and enjoy the credits.
investigates the research from a military base located on an island to the south. The military's top secret weapon, Shadow, sealed in the space of the Park, the Seven Chaos Emerald. When all of the keys have been collected, world conquest will be the end. Sonic Adventure 2, The Dark Side Story. Long live the Eggman Empire. So there's a sneak peek of the next two videos right there. So anyways, guys, we're going to wrap up for this video. So next time we're going to be beginning pretty much the dark story. Because we have now finished the hero story. So anyways, you guys like this video, make sure you like, and subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys in the next video. Until then, peace out as we continue our road to Sonic Frontiers.